Hi everyone. I'm Dan. I'm Damien. This is Dominic. There we go. And today so I have this air Silly compressor. Dominic. Now this air comp compressor is weighing in at 30 kilos. And at today's prices, this would fetch me $9 as it is. This current price is today are 30 cents a kilo. And um, I also asked about burnt copper, and burnt copper is $6.05 a kilo. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to cut this open and find out if I would have been better off selling the compressor as it was, or removing the copper from the motor to see if the copper is worth more. So what we're going to do is, we're going to cut this open now, and then after I've removed the motor, I'm going to also demonstrate how to remove the copper from the motor. So all we're going to need is a grinder. Yes. Do we need a grinder? Some safety glasses. Yes. If if you get anything on your eyes. These later on for holding the motor. And, and a hammer for tapping the copper off the motor. Rightio, we're back, and this is now cut open. Yes. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to remove this motor section out. Yeah, it would, it would be no, it would, the fire was noisy. And the yeah, that would have wood in there. Yeah, this would be fine. Here we go. That's the motor section out. That's the motor. And yeah, you, that's the motor. But all wet. Yeah, yeah. And as yes. you can see, that's why I cut near the bottom, so this that way it makes these plastic. closer. Easy to pull out, okay? You can access these screws a lot easier and it makes removing all the heavy duty Daddy? metal better. You are going to take this out. Yes, I Daddy, will take them out, but not now. Okay, look out, boys. It's not ready. That's ready. Yes, it's already. Dad, yeah, that's not ready. You, you, you want to take a look inside? This have these in. Show them. Show them what's inside. This on these ones. That there things. is what we're after. Yes. The copper inside, okay? So now I've got to so now I've got to remove this. So let's let's maybe open wider. Rightio. Now. So what? We, rightio. So what we've done now is I've just had to uh, make a cut, a cut along here, and a cut along here because I don't like to come out too convincingly these motors when they get stuck up here. So I've just <coughs> made a cut, screwdriver, and I'll give it a little bit of a helping hand. So we have a hammer. Some some that has to be careful. So she's uh, coming out slowly. Difficult to um, hear the children in the background. Yeah. Too much to bother. There we go. That. Those bits and pieces of the motor over there, I'll take care of that later on. Yeah, we will do. We take that care of you. So here we, we go. This is the big brute <coughs> that we've removed. So now, next, what we've got to do is we've got to remove this copper here from this steel casing. Yes. Now, what we're going to do next is we're going to get the grinder. And we're going to cut this one end all the way around. And then after that, we'll get a hammer. And we're going to tap it around and it should just fall off. Thank <laughs> you. 
So, so now, now we've been wide cut wide open now. So what have we done? We've cut this off now, haven't we? Here yes, we go. You look at That's it. what we've removed with the grinder. Yes. So next, we're gonna get the hammer. Yes, I'll, I'll, I'll get the hammer. Clamps. My dad. Hold it. Daddy. Yeah. It it is wet. It's all right. Give me that. That is so wet. It can be quite heavy. What's well, not heavy for me? Put that the hammer. We gotta smack that open. Let's smack that open. Just about done here. Just tap around the sides. This particular one is quite heavy with all that steel on it. Daddy, turn on the video. Just so. pause while I was doing it just to uh, get through it a bit. A bit of time. Oh! And there we have it. Yeah, well, you, you see this? If you touch these, they, they are a bit yucky. Yeah, they are a little bit yucky, but yucky. we're going to move this steel out of the way. Yes, Dad, probably okay. we, we could take this out. Uh. No, don't worry about that. We'll take that out later. Yes, we will take it out. Oh, come on, Daddy! I'm not going to stop the heat Move it to the side. Little old, all that steel will go to the heavy. Heavy gauge steel coil. Hang on. Just gonna just cut these. Well, don't have to worry too much. I mean, let's just weigh this now as it is. Yeah, sure, I've got to remove a little bit of plastic, just the top part of these wires, but overall, I don't really think it's gonna make a huge difference to the overall weight. So I'm going to chuck this on the scales and I'll find yes. all the ways. Yes. Yes. So let's put these on top. Yeah. Wow. So this so probably... We've got, uh, we've got it. We've got, Dominic, shut up please. You can't even read what you're looking at there. Okay, so what we're looking at here is a total of 2.9 kilos and 44 grams. So just a, just a shade under three kilos for a 30 kilo air compressor motor. Wasn't that heavy one? I'm actually uh, pretty happy with that, to be honest. Yes. So what does that work out to be? What, 6, 12, 18? There's at least roughly $18 of copper here compared to $9 if we just sold the air compressor motor as it was. Yeah. Now don't don't forget we've also got the heavy gauge steel over there. I haven't actually weighed that up but um, I'd say that will probably bring me closer to around about $9, um, $19.50 in total. So that's that. I'm gonna go and clean this up and I'll add it to my uh, ever growing pile of burnt copper and um, thanks for watching. Sorry about the children with all the noise but uh, what happens when you got kids. Thanks guys. If you like the video, add a comment. Feedback is always good. Subscribe if you like. Thanks guys. Bye bye.